I am so deeply honored and elated to be here tonight with all of you. This is an extraordinary celebration. I want to thank my amazing family for being here with me tonight. Um, particularly, I want to thank my father, who's every day, the way he lives and the way he gives is my role model and I never would have been able to start this organization without your support. I love you. I also want to thank Lindsay Austin Louie, the extraordinary Lindsay and Lance Force, your leadership these last two years have taken SV2 from a starting place as a new nonprofit to an extraordinary journey that all of us are so blessed to be on. And it is your leadership that makes us what we are today. So thank you both, Lance and Lindsay. And of course, to Mr. and Mrs. Fors, who flew across several states to be here tonight. Your son rocks. Thank you so much for having him. As many of you know, the actual definition of philanthropy has nothing to do with money. Deriving from the Greek word philanthropos, it actually means love for fellow mankind, especially the active effort, the active effort to promote human welfare. As everybody knows who's here in the room, giving money is just a tiny part of what it means to be a philanthropist. In fact, anyone who has anything to give whether it's their time or their expertise or their innovation or their creativity or their comfort or their compassion or their compassion is a philanthropist. And what I have found in my experience, particularly these last 12 years in SV2, is that so often the philanthropy of action trumps the philanthropy of money every time. SV2 is the embodiment of the philanthropy of action. And yes, I did have the idea of creating SV2. And yes, I, along with Peter Hero, um, whose amazing leadership helped take the idea into a seat of reality, but it is you, it is the partners of SV2 that have built SV2 and that make SV2 what it is today. For the last 12 years, you have been dedicated to this vision of a philanthropic community. And you have designed and refined and implemented the SV2 model time and time again. And you, you've determine our grant making guidelines. You've educated yourselves. You've educated one another. You've made our funding decisions and you have powered or you have partnered so powerfully with each of our grantees. At every step of the way, it is the SV2 partners who have been committed to this power of pooling philanthropic resources. Resources of every form. It is the SV2 partners who have created a contract, not only with one another, but also with our grantees to hold ourselves to the highest standards of philanthropic accountability. And it is you, the SV2 partners, who have channeled your expertise, your innovation, your passion, your time, your intellect, and your dollars 
into this organization. I think what I am most proud of when I look at this extraordinary group of people is that very fact that we are a group of people. We are a community. And to echo the point of everyone who's spoken here this evening, what we can do together and what we have done together is so infinitely greater than what each of us could have done on our own. And we here at SV2 are bound together by a few shared core beliefs. We all believe in the basic human right to opportunity and the deep honor it is to help provide that right. We believe that contributing to our community and to our world is critical and that merely living in it is far from enough. And most of all, we believe that it is our generosity to others that is the most beautiful sign of a life greatly lived. We here at SV2 have united in force around these beliefs and we have created together transformational impact in our world, in our community. And my deepest gratitude to everyone here today for walking this philanthropic journey with me and together. Tonight is literally a dream come true and we would never be here without every one of you. So thank you.